Lil Rye uh, getting jumped. Perfect timing. I can I can't wait. I I need to see I need to see some more than that happen. Because with me, with me seeing how he talk on his songs, how he screaming, screaming in his songs, he a hoe, he he whatever you want to call him, whatever everything related to being a vagina, he that. Because there's no way he own all these songs screaming at the top of his lungs. He scream on his songs. I'm talking about nah, like like scream at the top of his lungs when he when he rapping, like so he like he trying to make show you scared. So. How was it that you screaming at the top of your lungs? I, I I remember you said a song like, just this year alone, we got five bodies. You said that on the song verbatim. You said, just this year alone, we got five bodies. Okay, this how we know. This, let me tell you how you know a rapper cap. This how you know a rapper cap. That thing did nothing to nobody. If a rapper walks around freely, Ain't nobody scared of nobody. Let's let's just get that out the way. It ain't no such thing as people just scared of him and they don't want to do nothing. It's no such thing as that in the streets. It's always somebody who will get you out of here. Ain't no such thing. So the fact that this man think he could walk around freely with just one person with him, that's because he ain't did nothing to nobody. He's soft. He ain't really step on nothing. That's what that means. You're not going to find somebody like King Vaughn walking around by himself. Cause you only one man, you feel what I'm saying? You you only one man. You can't you you can't look at every angle while you going around. You just can't do it. So you need people around you who like that as well. And the one person that I seen him with was like a white boy or something. Like he looked like he was a manager or something. People were saying that was a what was a four PF or four L. Someone said four L. Yeah, someone said it was four L. Then I heard people saying it was young boy. Like what do you? Because the, they were saying people were screaming what four KT. 4K, 4K Trey, man, that wasn't even... It ain't nobody going to scream 4K Trey, they said, that you like just running Atlanta. But I'm just seeing what the comments say. You know how Man, Lil Rob, bro, you out here going out bad, bro. It's no way somebody supposed to be able to run down on you like that and some not post, some don't happen to them. Nobody get, 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 you know what I'm saying, dealt with right there. Somebody should have passed away. You or them should have passed away right there. They, they walked up to you and took your stuff, man. He said he didn't get his chain took. That's what he said. It don't matter. They took his clothes. He paid for the clothes. <laughs> they took his puree bag. They he a pure hoe. It's crazy that you went to puree and you got pure hoe, bro. It do hit different when you a pure hoe, bro. And and the only reason why I can say that is because the way you scream out loud with all the might in your songs, like, like, bro, I, I need to find a song where you were screaming like. Nigga, like, bro, come on, bro. You scream louder than Young Boy doing his songs. You said you get shit cooking too. That's what you said, bro. So it's no way that you feel that you can walk around. You see people who really doing something to somebody. You want to know why King Von left Chicago? It's because he said, "No, nah, if I stayed in Chicago, they gonna they gonna keep." First thing I did when I got out of jail, I went to go get me a weapon. That's the first thing he did when he got out of got out of jail. Because he knew if he walking around in Chicago, people gonna try to do something. He said that out of his mouth. They they trying to they trying to kill me. They trying to do something to me. But ain't nobody trying to do nothing to you though. Cause you ain't did nothing to nobody. King Von went to Atlanta and he was robbing people back and forth. He was rich and robbing people. Punching up on folks. Punching on people. So he can't just walk around Atlanta just lacks a daisy, just nah, he can't do that because he really liked that. The fact you that comfortable to do that is because you know you don't got no real smoke. You ain't really did nothing to nobody that's super serious to where they feel like they want to come do something to you. That's why you that comfortable to do that. So after you got and you got stripped out your clothes, your shoes, nah, bro. They nah, bro. Got. Your gangster card has been stripped, bro. You can never talk crazy like that because you ain't do that to them 4L folks. And you definitely don't want no smoke with Baby Drill because everybody know what's up with Baby Drill. He got at least five of them. And what he, I forgot. What did he say about Young Boy that you said when he was like staying in a little boy place? He was talking about Young Boy too. He don't like, want to smoke with he YB. The, he the rookie of the, he like the little rookie. He come to the show so I can murk his whole clique at the show. 
No, that that's what that's what a young boy said about yeah. him, right? But what did what did Lil Rye, Lil Rye uh, say? initially say to get young boy provoked? I think he said something like, "I'm gonna take a trip to Utah and some some like that." He ain't trying to do that. You ain't gonna make it in Utah with young boy. You couldn't even make it in Atlanta. 